There has been a worldwide outpouring of sympathy for Prince William as members of the public shared their admiration for his dedication to his royal duties which he honored as the King and Kate battled cancer. The Prince of Wales has attended around a dozen royal engagements since pulling out of the memorial service for his godfather King Constantine of Greece due to his wife's diagnosis on February 27. And now people have expressed their best wishes for William as he supports Kate and his family while balancing his royal engagements as the future king. He has been praised for putting on a brave face as he performed his duties including Earthshot Prize meetings and the Diana Legacy Awards in honor of his late mother. Royal supporter Chrissy Grace posted on X, formerly Twitter, this evening, My thoughts tonight are also with HRH Prince William as I can only imagine how he must feel having both his father and wife diagnosed with cancer and wanting to stay strong for his family and nation putting on a brave face. Another fan of the royal family Emily Hewartson tweeted, Prince William is an incredible man. I can't imagine how much courage it must have taken to continue with his duties, whilst dealing with the devastating news that both your wife and father have cancer. True dedication to his country. And the male's own Richard Eden gave his support for the prince, writing, Huge credit to our future king, Prince William, for the way in which he has carried out public engagements, with strength, dignity and a smile on his face over recent weeks with all this going on behind the scenes. Prince William pulled out of a memorial service for his godfather King Constantine of Greece due to Kate's cancer diagnosis. The Prince of Wales' absence from the St. George Chapel event at Windsor Castle on February 27 had raised eyebrows, but tonight's revelation about the princess' health has shed new light on why he stayed away. But since then, he has taken part in around a dozen royal engagements, showing his dedication to his position as the future king. On February 29, he visited the Western Marble Arch Synagogue in central London to take part in discussions about the rise in anti-Semitism in Britain. He met with Holocaust survivors René Salt, as well as young people who have taken part in the Holocaust Educational Trust's flagship lessons from Auschwitz Project. He was given a bouquet of flowers for Kate as he stood with Rabbi Daniel Epstein, who has headed up the Marble Arch Synagogue since 2021 with his wife Alana. On March 11, William attended the Commonwealth Day service with Camilla, Princess Anne and the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh at Westminster Abbey. The heir to the throne was pictured leaving Windsor Castle with the Princess of Wales. However, she did not attend the service because of her recovery from her surgery. And on March 14, the Prince of Wales attended the Diana Legacy Awards at the Science Museum in London. William took the stage to AC, DC's song Thunderstruck, which he referred to as George's song, before telling the audience himself and the Princess of Wales channel Diana's legacy through their work.